Did you know there is an island of plastic floating in the ocean between California and Hawaii, about twice the size of Texas? This is not the only one either. There are a total of five garbage patches throughout the ocean. Have you heard of the name Boy and Slat? Neither had I until I did some research. At age, only age 20, he's only 24 and at age 18 founded the Ocean Cleanup. He created such an amazing plan at such a young age to, clean, to help clean up the oceans and it's amazing. It's saddening to think how awful pollution has become, but because of people like Slat, there's a chance to fix this problem faster than I would have thought. I chose to talk about Boyan because he was such a, at such a young age, he began to show exceptional skills. He was devoted to his project and he is also driven not letting his obstacles get in his way. I don't know about you, but when I was young, I wasn't working to create such an amazing plan to clean the oceans. I was about to go into high school at age 14. Boyne Slap began his interest in science when he was really young. All before 18, he was on the path to help clean up our oceans. In fact, at age 14, he set a Genesis world record for launching 213 water rockets simultaneously. And at age 16 was when his interest in water pollution had really begun. He devoted his high school project to investigating ocean plastic pollution. Which brings me to when he began, turned 18, he started, began to start up his ocean cleanup project. In 2012, he presented a TED talk of a system he came up with to combat the pollution. And this is where I begin to show how he devoted, how he was so devoted to the ocean. Like a lot of well-known successful people we know, of, we know about, Boyan dropped out of school to develop his project, and not long. And this was not long after his TED talk. He stopped his study at the Delft University of Technology in the Netherlands to vote to devote all his time to developing the Ocean Cleanup Project. In 2013, Boyan founded his nonprofit organization, the Ocean Cleanup. Because of all Boyan's devotion and. In his success with his prototypes, his organization was able to launch the first cleanup system in 2018. But unfortunately, no great project can go perfectly as planned. Boyan was very driven though. Just a few months after launching the first system, they ran into problems and had to bring it back to shore. And Boyan had a ton of critics bashing him and his project saying how it could not have worked. Despite what people were saying, Boyan was confident in his research. A quote he said was, when launching the system, we knew that we had to accept that uncertainty remained, end quote. Even with all the obstacles, Boyan is still motivated and hopes to relaunch in a couple months. Boyan Slat saw a problem in the middle of the Pacific Ocean and wanted to make a difference. He had a, dri he had a drive and a devotion to make this change and it will be really amazing to see how much he will accomplish as time goes on. Thank you for listening.